Hey guys, welcome back to another video tutorial. Dusty here. Today I'm going to be showing you how to screen share on a Discord channel. So anyone who comes into the voice channel uh, will be able to see your screen and what you are doing. Uh, you can do this via a group message very simply, but I'm going to show you how to do it and set it up on a server itself. So first thing you need to do is log in the Discord, obviously, and you are going to need to get a couple of things from your Discord channel and your uh, server ID. So what we're going to need to do is go here and you can see I'm going to need my server ID, which is the Discord server, and then channel ID is going to be the actual voice channel. So in order to get these things, let's hop back on over to Discord. But before we can get either of these things, we need to change a setting. So go down to the cog wheel in the lower left hand corner that says user settings. Click that guy there, then go to where you see appearance. So go all the way down to where you see appearance. Scroll all the way down to where you see developer mode. Go ahead and check that there. Make sure that box is checked. And then once it is, go ahead and X out of the settings. All right, once we've activated developer mode, go back to Discord and then up here on your server where you see the drop down arrow here, right click on that and you'll see something here at the bottom that says copy ID. Go ahead and click that there. Or if you wanted to, um, you could even go over here, right click on the actual server image and then you can also copy the ID there as well. Go back to our document that we were just now forming and go ahead and paste that here. So go ahead and paste that there. So we now have our uh, server ID. Now we need to go ahead and add another backslash there. And now we're going to need to find our channel ID. So go ahead and hop back over to Discord. Now the channel ID is going to be the actual voice channel. Now this is not going to work in an, a text channel. This isn't going to work if you paste this link in a browser. It's only going to work in the specified voice channel that you are copying the actual ID for. Go ahead and right click on that. Go to copy ID just like we did for the server. Hop back over to our document and paste that here. All right, now I have the discord app.com slash channel slash server ID slash channel ID. I want to copy that entire link. So go ahead and go there, select all of that, right click or command or control C, copy that entire link and bounce back over to discord. Now, in order for this to work, you need to be a part of the actual voice channel. So select and, and be a part of the voice channel here. Go to the area where you can type a message at the very bottom, like you're just typing something in the, in the channel, and then go ahead and, and paste that link that we created. Now, if we do that, this is going to come up and you're gonna see the link available to you here. Click that link. Now, once the process has started, you're gonna see the option at the bottom of the screen, and if you hover over the monitor with the arrow there, it's gonna say turn on screen share. If we do that, we're now gonna be presented with a couple of different options. You can see here, I can change my stream quality, I can change my frame rate, I could even go and select only a specific application to share if that's what I wanted to do. Now, a few of these options may only be available to Nitro members, but you'll be able to screen share just the same even if you're not. And then once you're ready to go, go ahead and click share, just like that, and now as you can see, I am sharing my screen and you'll have all of the normal options where you can go and mute your microphone, turn your video camera on if you have one, go to user settings and change those things here. Now, when you're ready to end or turn off screen share, you just click this here, more screen share options, stop sharing your screen and then disconnect and you are good to go. So that's how you screen share to an entire Discord server. If you have any questions, please put those in the comment section below. Or if you want a full Discord user guide, I did one of those as well. I'll link that in the description as well as in the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video.